Build that wall. Build that wall. Throughout President Donald Trump's run for presidency, he had a goal in mind, to build a wall on the Mexican border. Today, that seems almost a reality. This is Joey Mitchell, and you're listening to Skills USA News. Trump's idea of keeping illegal immigrants from America is to keep them out with a wall. Before, the border was fenced for 600 miles across the Mexican border. On top of that, border control security would catch anyone going over the fence. Trump has in mind to build a 1,900-mile wall across the border. The cost of the wall in total would cost $45 billion. Trump stated that Mexico would pay for the wall in 2017. The Mexican president, however, denied Trump's request. Trump would instead issue a partial military shutdown to gain funds for the wall in 2018. The partial military shutdown greatly affected those that rely on a family member's income who had to work without pay. Many families from Mexico and the United States would be separated. Finally, in March of 2019, the Pentagon had issued $1 billion to engineers of the Army Corps to build more barricades. This broadcast is brought to you by Amazing Heights, the game show where the stakes are high and so is the tower. Five contestants can win up to a million dollars. Many of the challenges will test your mind and will. Hosted by no other than Danny DeVito, world famous actor. Many will fall, but only one will come out on top. Watch the series premiere this Wednesday, only on Fox 23. Hunter Reed caught up with Brad Hanselman, director at Tulsa Tech Riverside, to get his thoughts on Trump's border wall. I asked Brad Hanselman questions on how he believes the wall is affecting Americans socially and economically. There's not a simple answer to this. There's, it's a wide range uh, because it depends on what your background is, what your social persuasion or your political persuasion is, really. Economically, uh, a wall, I think, would protect American um, funds that we're currently using for social financing with uh, welfare and for um, supporting of the illegal immigrants. Brad believes that the wall would be a good idea for America, but will have some drawbacks. America is split between building a wall or keeping the border fence. I think socially, the way that it's been approached so far has caused a large divide in America. That's all for today. We will keep you updated on Trump's border wall as we follow this story. This was Skills USA News. This broadcast is also brought to you by Skills USA. Skills USA is a United States career and technical student organization serving more than 395,000 high school, college, and middle school students. Enroll in training programs in trade, technical, skilled service occupations, and health occupations. Compete in many areas of expertise. With many ways of improving yourself as a student, Skills USA is the right organization for you. Skills USA, preparing for leadership in the world of work.